All right, I wanted to show you just a, a little um, macro that we created. Um, I think it's really useful, especially for human resource people, because uh, sometimes you need to combine a whole bunch of separate um, information, Excel pages, uh, into one big giant one so that you can run filters and some sorts and things like that. So we created this uh, macro to be able to do that. Um, so you can just download it, and then once it's downloaded, uh, double click on it, it'll open it up. And here's the macro here. Um, all the instructions are right here for you. Um, so it's very simple to use. Um, the first uh, step really is to just um, select your folder. So um, if you click on that, it'll say there's an error. You gotta make sure you allow uh, macros. So um, no problem, that's right here. And then you can just enable this content. Don't worry, there's no viruses or anything like that. So it's just a simple macro. So, um, so first you click on get file names. And this will bring you to uh, wherever your files are stored. So um, you can see here, we downloaded payroll information from all these different years. And um, if you um, select a given folder, whichever folder you want, uh, it'll, it'll, um, it'll list them all here, all the individual, individual files that are in that folder. So you can see these are uh, payroll weeks for us. Uh, one after another after another um, for those um, people. So they're all exactly uh, consistent. And when we copy them all into one big giant Excel spreadsheet, um, it saves us a lot of time, a lot of chance to make mistakes um, because this will do it automatically. So, um, and you could, if you wanted actually to combine all the years, you could first combine each year separately and then put them in one folder and then combine all those years together. And that's what we ended up doing. So we actually have from 2002 all the way to current one big Excel spreadsheet with everybody's information on it. So we can do all sorts of searches and things like that. So you saw when these files got put in here, a uh, pop-up said that to select combined files, put a one by each one you want. So uh, this way you can select only the files you want. Uh, in this case, we're gonna select them all. Um, so no problem, just select them all. And then um, once you have whatever one's selected, you just click right here, combine uh, files that are selected, and it will go through them. And it's gonna combine them all um, into one big giant file. So uh, where does it put that file and what does it call it? Uh, well, it's going to uh, call it whatever the name of your initial folder was. So in this case, it's gonna be called 2002. And it's gonna be put in the same directory uh, where your um, combined tool is, where this tool is. So wherever the tool is, that's where that folder will be. So, and then you can just um, open it up and you can see here now it combined all of our data. Now, um, the headings are there from each file, so um, so that way you can still see that they're separate. Um, you know, if you wanted to see, oh, a particular um, week or something like that, the weeks are still separated out. Um, and you can always, of course, uh, filter and then um, um, get those all uh, put together if you filter by the right uh, by the right thing, for instance, department. If you uh, filter by that, um, you'll be able to uh, sort those all out um, there. So, and we just want department, and then it would uh, put those all together. So, um, so it's a pretty useful tool, especially in human resources. Uh, we we do this a lot, and um, so uh, just wanted to. Uh, show you that and you're welcome to use it. It doesn't cost anything or anything. You can just download it uh, from this video here and then you'll be able to um, um, use it again for yourself. So uh, if you have any questions or anything, uh, just let us know. Um, but uh, otherwise, like I said, here's all your data. Um, it combines it all together. So thank you very much. Take care and good luck. Bye-bye.